I'm standing right here by the theater of ancient Corinth with the gymnasium stretching off to my left. But what I've come here for is in Romans chapter 16 and verse 23. And it's the inscription that this fence is around. It's this rock right here in front of me. The word that's chiseled into this rock is in the book of Romans chapter 16. So if you grab your Bible, let me show you how fascinating it is to see archeology span uncover things from the Bible. This is what it says in verse 23. Gaius, my host and the host of the whole church at Corinth greets you. Now here's the part that this inscription has. Erastus, the treasurer of Corinth greets you. Did you know that God needs two kinds of believers in every church? When Paul came here to Corinth and ministered for a year and a half, the first people he met were Priscilla and Aquila. They were very nomadic. I mean, they came from Rome, they visited and ministered with Paul here, they left here and went to Ephesus. They were from Pontus. They were kind of traveling people for the Lord. That's the first kind of person that God needs. Those who say, where's the need, Lord? What can I do? My schedule is open. My life is at your disposal. I want to be like Priscilla and Aquila. I just want to go wherever you want me to go. You know what we find with them? Everywhere they went, they opened their home. In Corinth here, Paul stayed with them. How would you like to have Paul as your house guest? When they were in Ephesus, they were discipling Apollos. They were always opening their heart, their home, their lives, their schedule to the Lord. But the Lord needs a second kind of believer, kind of like this inscription. You see Erastus? He's carved in the rock. He's not going anywhere. He's kind of like the people I knew over the years as being a local church pastor who are there every time the church doors are open and when they're not open, they're helping at the church and working at the church and serving at the church. And you can always count on them. They're there. And if you need people to do things, they're there. Two kinds of servants of the Lord, the mobile ones. Their, their schedules free and open for the Lord and the fixed ones like Erastus, the treasurer of this city of Corinth. I hope that you'll decide today that in some local church, either you'll say, I'm available, my schedule's open, I'll go anywhere, what do you need me to do? Or you'll just be there all the time, helping in any way and staying totally invested in a local church.